Hello everyone, and welcome to my plush review of Great Eastern Supersonic Plush. Uh, now, based off the title of this video, you can already tell that this is a pretty great plush. But let's go into detail. Alright, so here we go. So the GE for Great Eastern are known for making great plushes. I only have one other of their great plushes, but it's silver, and he's actually really good. But we can talk th about him on another video. Right now, it's all about Super Sonic. Alright, so let's get started. First off, let's start off with some uh, things that you can see automatically. Basically, we used um, uh, a yellow, um, uh, we used yellow from uh, his fur color, obviously, because Sonic, Super Sonic, usually tends to take on this more golden yellow. Like, sometimes they make him golden, other times they make him yellow. Alright. <clears throat> and they use a tan color for his skin tone, which makes sense, because that's how Sonic's supposed to look. Sonic movie. And, um, uh, the gloves are really well made. And, um, uh, yeah, it just looks great right now. The fingers are correctly, um, uh, they're the correct number of fingers. Some Sonic plushes are, are, have, like, six fingers, or just straight up not the right amount. But, yeah, this one, I'm happy to say that this one has the right amount of fingers. So, yeah, like I said earlier, it's a really good, really good details on this plush. And this, this is, um, uh, I kind of help uh, get a Sonic Hero Super Sonic vibe from this. Um, uh, maybe with how the, the eyes look. But then again, they did also use this kind of style for their silver. But at the same time, I guess it just somewhat looks a little bit more Sonic Heroes-esque with, um, uh, the Super Sonic. Alright, so let's get to the mouth detail. He has a bit of, um, uh, a frown? Or, like, uh... He has, like, a pretty normal, um, uh, mouth expression. Although I think of it as a little bit of a frown. Like, he's somewhat annoyed. Alright. Uh, and, um, uh, something else about the face is that his nose is, like, um, uh... I don't know why, but they made his nose super floppy. However, for some of their other, for some of their other plushes, they made it to where that it's, like, this? Like... For some reason, his raises up, and I think that maybe because of, oh, he's supersonic. But um, at the same time, I think that that's just like something unnecessary. Kind of makes the nose, uh, you know, a bit odd. Oh, still, um, uh, when you're looking at the front of it, um, uh, and you're not, uh, not touching it, it actually looks really good. So yeah, now we're done with the face details. Let's move on. Per usual, um, uh, Sonic has his little um, uh, skin circle around um, uh, his chest, and it looks really good, actually. Like, um, uh, especially in real life, like, it looks amazing. Alright, so now, obviously, he has yellow legs, and, um, uh, his shoes are really well made, too. Um, uh, look at this. I'm gonna let, um, uh, the footage speak for itself. This looks genuinely amazing, like, even, hold on, even the white buckle down there has, like, a little thing, like, you can actually lift it up a little bit. So, yeah, and it even has, like, a little sock part that overlaps with the other sock. It looks really good. Both of his ears are really good. Per usual, the GE plush has a little tag thing that you can put on your door. Here's where it get here's where it gets good, ladies and gentlemen. His spines are so well detailed. Um, uh, they just really look like um a uh, game like Sonic Unleash styled uh, Super Sonic spines, and um uh, his um uh, his back spines are even more like a uh, they're a little more laid back, I would say. Like they look a little bit longer, which is somewhat like um uh, the Super Sonic. And, um, uh, yeah, the plush's spines are, like, really one of the best parts about this plush. Especially because, you know, it's super Sonic if they just made it to where that it was, like, just the average Sonic plush, just, um, uh, yellow. Then it would obviously be pretty panned universally. Alright, why don't we see Super Sonic in action?
like I said earlier, this bad boy is one of the best Super Sonic plushes, if not the best, and one of the greatest Sonic plushes in general, especially with such a... And Super Sonic is one of the most important characters inside the entire Sonic franchise. So yeah, I'm glad that this really turned out great. And, um, uh, overall, this is a really good, um, uh, Super Sonic plush. And, uh, thank you, the viewer, for watching. And, um, uh, yeah.